22 years ago in the United States, not Japan or the United Kingdom, Aaliyah releases her third self-titled album on July 17, 2001, which would produce three singles. We Need a Resolution, Rock the Boat, and More Than a Woman. It's kind of hard to believe that when this album came out, I was only 14 years old. I'm 25 now. Oh my goodness, the time that has passed, bro. 2001 was a big year for music. Well, just like any other year is big in music. But 2001 was legendary. We had the king of pop, Michael Jackson, being brought out by NSYNC on the 2001 MTV Video Music Awards. And on that same stage, Britney brought out a snake. Kind of like Aaliyah had in her video. But anyways... I remember solely at 14 years old with my VHS tape when Aaliyah came on TRL and BET 106 in part to promote her We Need a Resolution video for her album Aaliyah. Now let's look at this video. We Need a Resolution. Can we get into the makeup? Can we get into the hair? Can we get into the scenery? Can we get into the outfits? Can we get into the dancing? Can we get into the rapping by Timbaland? Can we get into the beat? It's just perfection in her face. Oh, everything is just flawless. It was the perfect single to drop as her debut single from that self-titled album. Explosive, baby. Unfortunately, when Rock the Boat came out, she was no longer here with us. Her murder, I hope, soon does get coverage. And this was released a day before my birth. Bro, a day before my birthday. A day before the Twin Towers came down. What? Bro, this year, this year was crazy. It was crazy. Not even two and a half weeks prior, we lost the princess of R&B. Should be queen. And... The Twin Towers come down a day after the release date of Rock the Boat. Bro, what? This is crazy. Let's get into the video. So this comes out a day before my birthday in 2001, man. I do believe so. And she gives us just not one, not two, but five beautiful looks. It was so seductive, so sexy, so different from the Aaliyah we've been getting all those years. It was very grown up and uh, I wasn't complaining. Look, man, she comes walking to the screen. She came walking to the screen and I'm like, Tyrese, oh my God. Oh my God. Next scene, she's on the boat with the white outfit, the curly hair, that black skin that's just looking so good with the dancers in the middle of the ocean. It's just... Oh, that was such a vibe. And from there, it goes straight to her dancing on water in her, uh, what do you call those knickers? With that, that, uh, that, that white top. Oh, and the straight hair. Oh, and the, the make, oh, the makeup was so on point. Name a female prettier, I'll wait. Bro, and from that scene, she went straight into this little red fishnet uh, over top uh, of this like little bra thing she had going on. Some coochie shorts with these red leggings and this red hat with the curls. Oh, it was everything. She was like just like uh, moving her body sexy on the beach. And oh, my gosh, it's like back and forth and side to side. And oh, my gosh. Yeah. And straight from that scene, she goes right into the ocean. She was she was calling out for Cordell, bro. She was literally call, she was reaching out for Cordell, bro. It was literally like all in the video. Like she was reaching out for me, bro. We miss you. We miss you. We miss you. Let's get into the more than a woman video. Oh, my gosh. Baby girl starts on this motorcycle. It looks so futuristic. This was made 21, 22 years ago. And it still looks fresh and crisp and brand new. And the sound still sounds fresh. Comes off of that. You know, she goes into that, that motorcycle scene straight through this tube, going down this tube and these pipes. And it goes, it opens up to her in this white cat suit. Oh, mother of Mary J. Blige and the Seven Disciplines. Oh, my God. When I tell you, bro, I was mesmerized like Ashanti says in the Ja Rule and Ashanti song, mesmerized. Bro, I was mesmerized. Do you, did you, did you see how pretty she, y'all don't see how pretty she is. Oh, my God. 
how pretty she was and bro bro and and then you know fast forward to the end of the video with the, the dancing and then she swaps the floor with that towel and it, uh, what what now single wise if you ask me i think the record label did a great job by releasing we need a resolution first that was big that that was smart that was a smart choice rock the boat even though she already wrapped more than a woman up already previously before her passing her murder that 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 order rock the boat right directly right after we need a re, res, we need a resolution <laughs> right directly after that and then more than a woman coming straight after rock the boat i thought that was great that was a great lineup. And then, you know, after her passing, you know, months after they, we, we released the, uh, they released the, um, the Miss You video with all her friends and people she was close to and adored and people who adored her. And then the I Care For You single thing I, I think came out of the I, I Care For You, blah, blah, blah. I'm yapping on. Which one, <laughs> which video, which song of those three or any of them on the album, on the Red Album, do you think was the best on that album? Or do you have favorites? Let me know in the comments. All right. I'm gone. <laughs>